Virgin MS. Nah, untuk memulakan projek dengan Microsoft Project adalah mudah. Kesan diperlukan jika anda ingin mengesan kemajuan projek anda. You know, if you want to tracking the project schedule lah. Dan jika anda ingin mengawal persembahannya. Baseline adalah rujukan. Baseline adalah rujukan. Anda lain tu. Anda lain. Langkah untuk inisiasi diikuti dengan konsepsi, perancangan, laksanaan, realisasi dan penutupan projek. Anda perlu tahu perancangan projek. Kos dari projek. Penghantaran. <coughs> Scope harus dilakukan. Reverse ataupun margins dimasukkan dalam projek. Time, cost, fungsi barang diserahkan. Perlu pastikan tiada perutukan berlebihan dan anda mesti rasa yakin dan selesa dengan mendapatkan projek. So, sekejap hmm. tuan-tuan. Sekejap. <coughs> Sorry ya Ini ni, tunggu to toilet lah Okay <coughs> Any question? Any question? Any question about How to set baseline Baseline also can be Clear baseline After you get Or you Been instructed by SO verbally or officially. And officially is mean uh, you get a instruction by letter and letter approval. Uh, and if you get verbally unofficial, you need you need to clear baseline first. Hmm, you need to clear baseline first, huh? Because it's not officially, yeah. If if officially, uh, if uh, officially you get instructed, you need to maintain the set baseline and you revise the program. Why? Huh? Why? Because 
you need to check and take a look back from finish variant. Finish variant column means how differences between contract, due date, completion project and EOT revised due date completion project. You get the, the different. That different can save you. Same you save you from LED. Um, cost, re cost revise. Cost revise. Huh? Cost revise. And uh, also idling cost or prolongation cost. Huh? Uh, there's this, uh, this, this, uh, setting I also teach in others package. Uh, also teach uh, in others package. It's included in EOT setup. <laughs> uh, we have a one day only, uh, one day for EOT setup. Huh? I will teach, I will uh, train how to uh, hands on from Microsoft Project and how to determine the net NED, yeah, net. It mean net effective delay, yeah. Okay. Set the slide. Perubahan table, lah. So far, do you understand, lah? Huh? Understand, lah? Huh? Any question, lah? Huh? No question, lah? Huh? No question, okay, bye. No question, huh? <clears throat> okay. We go through to recurring so on. After naming the baseline finish, you need to determine status state. Let's take a look. How to determine status state? Hmm? Determine status date will ensure the generate schedule physical. It means the percent schedule and financial cumulative cost, cumulative cost by RM in current for progress report. You work together. It's work together. Once you tracking cut off date. It will generate based on percent shadow physical and by RM financial progress. Huh? Monthly tracking should be carried out at probably the same day. Huh? Stand up. Huh? <clears throat> on the accepted work program. Step to save accepted file as updated work program. On the accepted work program, you, you need to naming eh? save as as usual. Eh? This step is a uh, usual, eh? usual step. Eh? Name it update. Update it. Eh? Let's do it. Okay, now I just stop it. Eh? How to determine? Eh? How to determine? Okay, first, file, save. 